Wes Unsell, the former Washington Bullets superstar, passed away from pneumonia June 2nd of 2020 at age 74. Condolences to his loved ones and the entire NBA community. The 6'7 center is one of the most unique players in NBA history, one of the best players in the 70s. The wide you accomplished every big award as a Hall of Famer, named one of the 50 greatest players all time in 1997, enjoyed an amazing 13 year career. Born in Louisville, Kentucky, one of the best players to ever come out of the state, Unsell became the first African-American athlete to be offered an athletic scholarship to the University of Kentucky, but chose to enroll at his hometown school, the University of Louisville in 1965. One of the greatest college players all time, averaged 36 and 24 for the freshman team, over 20 points, 19 rebounds in three seasons for varsity, good enough to be selected the second overall pick by the Baltimore Bullets, made an immediate impact with his dominance on the glass and outlet passes. Wes wasn't known as a scorer but did all the little things to help his team win. Baltimore just won 36 games in the 68 season. The franchise never even went above 500 before Unsell's arrival changed the franchise around with his unselfish play, leadership, and winning attitude. When you think about centers, you imagine a 7-footer, a towering giant. Karina Lujabar, 7-2, played against Unsell many times, said, despite Unsell being undersized, you still couldn't get rebounds over him because he just denied position on the court. Awesome in that sense, Unsell himself also admitted he was just a hair under 6'6", despite being listed at 6'7". Our hustle guys half a foot taller than him, averaged more than 15 rebounds 5 different times, one of the best to crash the glass, and arguably the best outlet passer, his signature move. Nobody passed the ball better to get it out of their hands faster, full court, leading to a perfect pass to a teammate for a quick bucket, did all the dirty work, and never cared about his numbers, became the second second ever rookie to win MVP, joining Will Chamberlain, was the youngest at the time at 22 years old before Derrick Rose did it. Unsell averaged almost 14 points, over 18 rebounds, made first team all NBA, led his team to 57 wins, a 21 win increase, continued his relentless rebounding and laser beam outlet passes. Not a flashy player at all, but one of the most intelligent, personified by hard work, dedication and courage, knocked off the Sixers and Knicks the first two rounds. After being swept by New York, his rookie season. Unsell's bowlers knocked off the Sixers and Knicks the first two rounds in 71. Teammates Earl Monroe, Jack Moran, and Fred Carter did most of the scoring, leading his team to the finals. In only his second year, did his part, averaged 15 and 9, 6 assists, but no match for Kareem and Oscar Robertson's Bucks got swept. After a subpar 500 campaign in 72, the Bullets traded for superstar forward Elvin Hayes, the first pick before Unsell, the perfect counterpoint to West, while the 6 9 power forward did most of the scoring, Unsell continued his blue collar work down low. The franchise moved to Washington in the 73-74 season. West missed 26 games due to a knee injury, but bounced back in 75, led the league in rebounds, 14.8 a game, 60 wins. Despite being the favorite in the finals, the Bullets were swept by Rick Barry's Warriors. By then, Unsell's stats were diminishing, but his value and leadership was as vital as ever, continued to crash the glass relentlessly, even averaged 5.2 assists as a 5 in the 76 season, and set picks to give his teammates easier opportunities. Simply one of the most unselfish players all time, Although the team fell short of 50 wins between 76 to 78, Unsell led with his presence, averaged 7.6 points, 12 rebounds in the whole 78 playoffs. Despite his scoring not being very high, his impact on defense, similar to Bill Russell, knocked off the Seattle Sonics in the 78 finals, leading his franchise to their first ever championship. Unsell won finals MVP, averaged 9 points a game, 11.7 rebounds, 4 assists, came Drew in game 7 when it mattered most. All star teammate Hayes fouled out early fourth quarter. Unsell once again did all the little things. The Bullets would have never won a championship without his greatness. Reached his four finals the following year but fell short to the same Seattle Sonics. Played for the Bullets for two more seasons after 79. Retired in 81 at 34 years old. Spent 13 seasons on the same team. Averaged double digit rebounding numbers in 12 of those seasons. In an era battling against Jabbar, Willis Reed, Bob Lanier, and Will Chamberlain. Giants amongst Giants. West managed to hold his own and 
nobody ever questioned his credibility as a true five. Many asked the great Willis Reed, who introduced Unsell for his Hall of Fame induction, how tough was it to play against Bill Russell and Wilt. Reed responds, people didn't really understand that when you play against Wes Unsell, he abused your body every night. Teammate Phil Chenier simply gained confidence just by looking at Unsell once he arrived. Just making eye contact was that powerful. His greatness simply doesn't get talked about enough, since most of his impact to winning wasn't shown on the stat sheet, wasn't a high scorer or an amazing athlete, but relied on his wide frame and wore down his opponents at the end of games. Rockets director of player personnel and former player John Lucas said, Wes was a mentor and a role model when he was dealing with drug issues. Unsell was always supportive and helped him out when the league didn't have any rules. Being a great man of integrity and character encouraged Lucas to do the right thing. After retirement, the Hall of Famer spent seven seasons as a coach, seven more as a GM, then owner A. Pollen had tremendous respect for the center and did everything to keep him around the team. The two were like family. Unsell served and dedicated his time for the franchise until 2003, 35 years of service. Current player Kevin Love's middle name Wesley was named after Unsell. His dad Stan Love was a former teammate of his and close friend. Love also got his outlet passing skills from his godfather. The greatest player in the history of the Baltimore slash Washington franchise, GM Tommy Shepard said, those of us who were fortunate enough to spend time with Wes knew him as a generous and thoughtful man whose strong will was matched only by his passion and drive for uplifting others. His physical progress, undeniable talent, and on-court demeanor might have struck fear in opponents throughout the NBA, but he will be remembered best as a mentor, leader, and friend. Simply one of the most underrated players all time, his leadership very similar to another former Finals MVP, another great that doesn't get appreciated enough, Chauncey Billups. Just like Unsell, not a high stats guy, somebody who uplifts and ignites his teammates and found plenty of success doing so. Unsell was 6 on the all-time rebounding list when he retired, currently at 12 right now. Number 1 in games played, minutes, and rebounds for his franchise, got his number 41 jersey retired in 1991. The greatest undersized center to ever play, a pioneer, proving it's not always about the height or the extreme athleticism, but his 100% effort each and every night made the most of his talents, leading to amazing results. The best comparison for Unsell in the modern NBA, 2014 prime Joe Kim Noah. Although he's 5 inches shorter and less of a shot blocker, but stronger, listed at 245 and way more dominant on the boards, somebody who can knock down the open 15 foot jumper when open, his pick setter will also frustrate a lot of opponents. Unsell simply one of those players you shouldn't judge a book by its cover, otherwise you'll pay the price. His greatness, classic afro, outlet passes, leadership, and legacy on the hardwood and off the court in the community drew the West Unsell's schools to enriching the lives of Baltimore youth will always be remembered. Thank you so much for watching this video. Rest in peace Wes Unsell, you will be missed.